his group credit for this, but the way they're playing it and playing it out has been the greatest play you could ever make for his brand. Because yes. I'm going to say this one more time. This is the irony for all those out there who don't get this about me. Longtime Spurs fan. Used to be this guy's biggest fan before anybody even really knew who he was. Yeah. I'm raving about him, beating the table over here. How about my guy? I'm going to call his old name, Kawhi Leonard. Yeah, Woo! yo, Kawhi. Well, that's when he was Kawhi no, Leonard. No, 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 he always going to be He that. was Kawhi the Claw. I was one of the first to say the Claw because they were already saying it down on the bench in, in San Antonio. They're doing the Claw and all that. And the point is, <laughs> he never spoke in San Antonio. No. Not once, and I watched every game, and you know how those games go. You always get a post game with somebody, the star of the game, yeah. like the home team, right? right? When you're at home, you get somebody. Never him. Never. I had no idea what he sounded like until about a month ago, maybe, when he started to talk well, after the games. He's so, not talking in meetings either. Okay. Uncle Dennis doing all the talking. Well, maybe, listening. maybe you're right about that. But my <laughs> point is, that guy who never spoke for seven years in San Antonio, who, by the way, was often injured in San Antonio and is very injury prone, as we even saw in the playoffs this year. That guy is now dominating the conversation. Mm -hmm. He's 